Oh, this is where you spend all night. Mostly. Yeah. So all, all the uh, workaholic uh, minister yeah. used to spend uh, most of their nights in this, in this office. Uh -huh. So I'm sorry if it's a little bit lousy. This uh, is not a lousy uh, office. <laughs> He spends most evenings in Riyadh's Erga Palace, where he dispenses with the traditional Saudi headscarf. And so what time in the morning are you here till working? Oh, I, 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 I come here at, like, uh, afternoon mm -hmm. till uh, late night. We're told his 82-year-old father, King Salman, is somewhere upstairs, leaving most of the day-to-day -day work to his son. <laughs> so, so, you should go? Yeah. He escorted us at 9 p.m. into this meeting about the public investment fund. <laughs> Under Prince Mohammed's detailed plan to remake Saudi Arabia, called Vision 2030, <laughs> the public investment fund will eventually grow to two trillion dollars. The men in this room are talking about how to invest it. They recently sank three and a half billion dollars into Uber. If bets like that pay off, it will be dividends, not oil revenues, pouring into the Saudi treasury.